Hi, this is Leila Torres. We will be folding this flapping bag. It makes a delightful puppet for Halloween. We have to use a 10 by 10 piece of paper. Uh, it has to be thin and firm. Like in this case, I have cami paper. Um, in this case, it's white on this side and black on this side. We start on the white side up and fold it border to border. In a half, open. Bring one border to the center. Rotate. Bring the other border to the center. make your crease sharp now each one of these corners we're going to bring it so that this row border aligns with the center i leave a little bit of a space like a hair to make sure that the paper doesn't get caught when i fold back so the other corner and leave a little gap here. Very small gap. Proceed to do the same with the oil corner. Again, leaving a little gap here in the center so that when we fold this way, paper doesn't get caught there. Now we are going to make a um, central crease just about here. It's going to be in the center and only a fraction of the whole length. And we are going to do this crease by bringing this border to this border. Hold tight and press in the center about an inch and fold you have a valley fold there then what you want to do is turn it over and keeping this short edge closer to your hand put your index finger on the center wrap it the bat around the finger, the wings, and with your left hand pinch custom fitting this area to your finger. Keep it pressed like that. Remove your index finger. A little tube of, or cylinder is formed. And press this area, this fold that we did previously, press it in. You can then help the two, the sides a little bit and that's what you want to get. Then at this point we're ready to Play with it. Hold it with your index and your thumb. And once you're let it, uh, ready to let go, press your fingers together. And once you let go, it lies flat. If you want to play with it again, again, wrap it around your finger, fold the wings together, hold with your left hand, press the little mark, and play. Now, for a variation, it can be made with different colored papers. 
then it is no longer a bat but a butterfly. Remember that the paper to use should be thin and crisp. I hope you have fun folding and making it flat. Thank you. This is Leila Torres from OriganiSpirit.com.